The Spiegel tent to me heralds uh, summer and a special time in Melbourne. It's when there's festivals, touring performers, uh, people exploring their own city, um, seeing that tram and the tent just in the forecourt as you come into the, the centre of Melbourne just um, is like a, a visual sign that there's something going on in town during summer. Dr Sketchy's anti-art school throws the idea of a sterile life drawing class out the window and invites you all to channel your inner Toulouse-Lautrec. Um, expect at a Dr Sketchy session inside the famous Spiegel tent to be entertained by the, the stars of the Spiegel tent that we don't often get access to in Melbourne throughout the rest of the year um, and reignite your creative spirit. There's an opportunity to get the performer to stay still when they're normally just bouncing around stage doing what they do best and take a moment to pause and get the opportunity to sketch them and um, capture their personality on a bit of paper. The other shows that I'm most looking forward to in the Spiegel tent would be um, definitely the Paris Blues burlesque, seeing Gypsy Wood is going to be a highlight, the Dirty Brothers and the Dark Party as well, and I will most definitely be coming out and having a dance to Kira Prue and the Brews. One of my very favourite Spiegel Tent memories would be having a room full of almost 200 people with pencils ready drawing uh, the king of boylesque, uh, Captain Kidd's private bits with bits of uh, tinsel attached while he stood there still on stage and having them all really intently look at that and, and, and capture that on a bit of paper. That was pretty wonderful.